Welcome to Math Window. Today we are going to solve this equation about x and y. We are given that x minus y is equal to 95 and the square root of x plus square root of y equals 19. How can I solve that? The first equation is about x and y, but the second equation is about square root of x and the square root of y. So we have to find the relationship between x and square root of x, y and square root of y. Everyone knows that x can write as square root of x, then squared. y can write as square root of y, then squared. Every non-negative number can write as square root of itself, and then squared. So now because x equals this and y is equal to this. So the first equation, we can write it as x minus y, that is square root of x, then squared, and then minus square root of y, then squared, is 95. So now we use a formula. We use the third binomial formula. The third binomial formula is that, that a squared minus b squared is a plus b, don't forget the bracket, and then times a minus b. We use this formula. And now square root of x is a, square root of y is b. So here is square root of x plus square root of y. But you can also write square root of x minus square root of y first. Both are okay. And then times square root of x minus square root of y is 95. We've known that the sum of square root of x and square root of y in our problem. The sum of them is 19. So the value of square root of x then plus square root of y is 19. So it is 19 then times square root of x minus square root of y. It is 95. We divide it by 19 on the both sides. So here we get square root of x minus square root of y is 95 divided by 19 is 5. And now we've known that the value of the subtraction of square root of x and square root of y. We've also known that the sum of them it is 19. So this is the first equation and this is the second equation. And how can we solve the value of x? If we get the, uh, if we get the addition, get the addition of the first equation and the second equation, and you can get square root of x minus square root of y then plus square root of x plus square root of y. 5 plus 19 is 24. And now, because here is negative square root of y, here is positive square root of y. So negative, positive, they can ask out each other. And here, square root of x, then plus square root of x, 2 times square root of x. 2 times square root of x is 24. And now we divide it by 2 on the both sides, and you can get the value of the square root of x. It is 12. In the same way, square root of x is 12, and the square root of y is square root of x, then minus 5. It's 12 minus 5 is 7. So we can get, we can also get the square root of y, the value of it is 7. Because we are going to solve the value of x and y, now the value of square root of x or square root of y. So we just squared on the both sides. So now you can get the value of x and the y. Square root of x then squared is x is equal to 12 squared is 144, 144. And square root of y squared is y. So y is 7 squared is 49. 
So our final answer is that x is equal to 144 and y is equal to 49. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up, give me a like, ring the bell, subscribe me, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.